We love to use this stick mobility stick for nice isolating, very simple isometric that most people would refer to as a version of a dead bug. We want the knees to be forward, the hips, my hand pressure drives it in. So it's a mutual pull of the knees and push the hands. But the key is I'm trying to flatten my low back. Imagine there's a marshmallow under there, crush it down. So it's a small pelvic tilt and we engage and you can engage up to very high intensities. It can be done with the head down, still great engagement of the lower abs. You can lift the head slightly and that activates this neck tissue, which interdigitates down through the uh, fascial system into your abs. So a little head raise actually engages the abs more. We follow up that isolation with a bit more movement and load. So my abs have a little bit more length as I come down here. Not big length, my hips are still flexed, but big tension as I come up in a classic sit-up. We love the, this version we call a Rocky because we can get up, we can get a little rotation. If somebody's strong, they could go up and go one to the other. You can see I'm not strong enough to hold that yet, but you could play with singles and doubles and triple rotations in versions of that classic sit-up. We close up that triple set of isolating to a little bit more integrated, but still lots of time under tension to a more fluid three-dimensional loading of the abdominals. So when I go uphill here, you can see the wrinkles in my shirt. Those are just like the fibers through the, the midsection being lengthened. They go up and they help bring me back home. So this same side rotational reach at overhead, lots of hip movement, lots of ankle movement, but lots of movement of the pelvis and of the rib cage. So we get lots of load at a long position in those abdominals. That triple set, pretty nice feel factor and pretty good movement benefit coming out of it.